This is Falling FM. It's the Cafe Towers programme, really. I'm sitting in today, um, following on from the We Don't Know show. John, John's still, um, still in the middle of Exeter, although he was going on about Central Exeter changing. He's, he's still here, but he's, he's, uh, I left him with, with Chris Norton uh, with coffee. There is, there is more and more coffee involved, but for various policy reasons, we're not allowed coffee in the studio. We have to work out how to get the recording into the, into the cafe. That's our, our long-term project. Um, just going through some of, the, some of the things that I said, it's, it's interesting to me that, um, in theory, if I'm by myself, I can I can just talk uninterrupted and express what I, what it is I'm trying to say uh, without John interrupting. But if he's here, I I say it more quickly. So I might I might go I might start to ramble, which doesn't doesn't work so well. Um, this thing about thank thank you for being late. You can look up thank you for being late. There's a book, and there was a, a keynote at a Coursera conference in London which is where I where I came across it then John John was saying that I'm not I'm how, how to he was sort of saying I'm not sincere or convincing when I say thank you for being late if he is late or not there at all um, so that's something I've got to work on I suspect this in this show when I, when I meet Kathy in in um, in person I shall ask her how how you can work on that, but the the idea of of um, welcoming occasions when people aren't there or are late because it creates um, gaps, spaces in which you can think. Uh, yeah, it does it does make sense because the the other end of it, if you get into the book, is about the the speed of change and how you can escape from that. I think that's what the book's about. But I'll come, I'll come back to that as well. Uh, anyway, I, I shall stop, stop there and go back to the, the music. <laughs> 